Okay, Sheldon here in Tucson. I'm dismantling uh, an old HP Workstation XW6600. And I couldn't find a video anywhere online that would show me exactly how to remove this motherboard. So I decided to make a video for everybody. Um, I came across one for like how to take the board out of an XW9400, I think it was. But even that was slightly different. Um, so this is... <coughs> Sorry, try better stay focused here. Um, but anyway, I took off the, um, the CPU number one heatsink assembly. And that was held in with four screws. And I just used a long uh, <coughs> flathead, <laughs> flathead screwdriver to take that off. And... Um, yeah, I took the cable and uh, plugged out the fans. But this is really easy. All you do, um, once you get all that stuff out, is you just um, slide the board to the right just a tiny bit, like that, and it just lifts. It just lifts right out of there. Isn't that amazing? And once you get the board out, this is what it looks like underneath. Then when, when you get the replacement board to put in, um, let's see here. Let's make pretend this is the new board or replacement board. So we just lay it down in here like this and just slide it to the left and um, it's in. Make sure you align these four holes here where you gotta put the heat sink assembly back in that. But that's how it is. See that? It just it slides to the right and left. You don't have to undo any of these uh, screws here on the motherboard at all. Those are you don't have to touch touch these screws here at all. Anyway, I hope you enjoyed my video. Thank you.